I always felt like skiers were obsessed with these untracked blank white spaces. But for me, I used to find them terrifying. There's a lot of hard parts when it comes to painting an Alaskan landscape in the winter, especially with watercolor. But I've always found that the hardest part was starting, just getting something on the page. With a pair of skis in the winter, I've been able to reach some landscapes in Alaska that just feel fake. So beautiful, it's almost like you're skiing through a painting, but a painting so big and remote that you need the right tools to even begin to capture it. With skis, sketching supplies, and a little bit of gin to keep my paint from freezing, I had everything I needed to make a winter watercolor. All that was missing was a place to start, which was easier said than done when the landscape felt as blank as my page. The first few trips, the only mark I left on anything white was with my skis. I glided over lakes and bushes, maybe even sleeping bears. The only things that I saw were the tracks of other winter artists, each making our own kind of mark as we crossed this gigantic bright canvas. Trying to capture anywhere this big was probably impossible. Watercolor certainly seems like an odd choice. The photo would be much quicker, and probably cost me far fewer fingers. But sketching, like skiing, can pull you into a place. So long as you can build the momentum to get past that first line. Because once you've built up the patience to do that, you can start to see the world move around you. The paint started to freeze, and my lines were pretty shaky. But this sketching helped me visualize what my skis could feel. It took finishing the sketch to make me realize that it wasn't about filling in the blank spaces. It was about connecting with them. Once I'd committed to that line, it really started to make me appreciate all the little pieces of this landscape. Including the chilly little accidents. Towards the end of the ski, I think I was finally beginning to understand why skiers are obsessed with these bright, untracked places. Winter doesn't cover up the landscape. It just highlights all the amazing little pieces. Okay. 